Hello there everyone, it's me, Red Tier Gaming, and welcome to another The Sims 4 room building video. So today we are building a bathroom in The Sims 4, and it's called The Oasis, which sounds like a strange name for a bathroom, but trust me, once you see how nice this is, you aren't going to question it at all. Uh, I imagine this would be more of like a shared uh, bathroom, like in a traditional family home, because it's more updated than one would expect in for it to be in like a Victorian house or anything. So let's just move on with it. So as you can see, I do believe I keep that large cabinet and shelving of course, just to create like a closed in vanity type feel. And there's that nice sink, even though it's a kitchen sink, I still put it in because why not? And I think I might actually change it out, but I'm not too sure. Blue is an accent color, just because why not have blue as an accent color? It's going to be great for some orange accents, which you will see in just a moment. Not all of the walls have a tiled finish, just because I thought it was a little bit unrealistic to have every single wall be tiled, especially the ones closer to the exterior. But as you can see, a nice classy toilet. And washcloths of course because you have to have some decor in there so this bathroom is called the oasis as i said earlier you can find it on the gallery um, by looking up the name the oasis or you can search my user origin id which is red tier gaming same as the username or you can go down into the description below and follow the link and that's pretty much it regarding how you can download this so as you can see, there is the nice orange accent. It's just a rug, and I don't think I do anything else for the orange. Um, a nice shower, and yes, that is the proper orientation that I end up going with, just because I thought it was really strange to have it any other way. I toned down the blue a bit by moving it and adding it to areas that weren't quite as eye-catching. It's more of a backsplash in the counter area. And against the door, it just looks a bit more natural. I'm not really sure why I put plants next to the toilet, because I've never seen anyone do that. But, you know, if you like plants, you've got plants right next to the toilet. I also put in a console table, which you will see right next to the tower and, tu the tower and tub. The shower and tub. And I thought it actually looked really nice, and I'm going to put in... Um, a painting above it. I believe I used the sunflower painting, but I enlarge it. And of course, I needed a window in the bathroom because bathrooms tend to need windows. So there is a window right there with a small curtain. I always like covering the bottom portion of a window because it allows light to still continue to come in, but people can't see. So that's just kind of a thing that I tend to do in pretty much all of my houses. As you can see, I put in the little ottoman with the towels and everything, so it kind of has a spa treatment vibe, and I believe that, for the most part, is what I did with this bathroom. You're going to see me put in the painting in just a second, and then I think we're going to be done, but I hope you all enjoyed the speed build. Speed build? No, this is a room build. Speed build to come. Christmas Day, so be on the lookout for that. I'm really trying to get that out, actually. So that's going to be really nice. It's actually something I drew the plan out for, so it should actually look really, really good because when I draw it out, it just always ends up looking a lot better. So you have that to look forward to. More room builds coming in the coming days. Uh, maybe a Sims 3 speed build. I don't know. I do know, and the answer is yes, so get excited. Um, so make sure you stick around on the channel. You can hit that subscribe button so that you don't have to come and look it up again. It'll just be sent straight to your subscription box. Um, I love you all. I'll see you in the next video and goodbye.